हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू द यूट्यूब चैनल ऑफ योर पेडियन इंजीनियर करियर पॉइंट सो आई एम विनीश शर्मा योर मेंटर ऑफ मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग सो बेसिकली आई एम हेयर टू डू द प्रीवियस ईयर पेपर एनालिसिस ऑफ द बी एच ई एल ओके सो यू ऑलरेडी नो दैट बी एच बी एच ई एल हैज आउट द वैकेंसीज फॉर द इंजीनियर ट्रेनिंग एज वेल एज द सुपरवाइजरी ट्रेनिंग ओके एंड देर अराउंड टू हंड्रेड टेन वैकेंसीज फॉर द मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग आउट ऑफ विच सेवेंटी वैकेंसीज आर रिलेटेड टू द इंजीनियर ट्रेनिंग एंड द रिमेनिंग वन फोर्टी पोस्ट आर फॉर द सुपरवाइजर ट्रेनिंग हेयर ओके सो लेट एस स्टार्ट विद द पेपर प्रीवियस पेपर एनालिसिस फॉर द इंजीनियर ट्रेनिंग हेयर सो दीज टू एग्जाम्स आर हेल्ड इन द ट्वेंटी नाइनटीन एंड ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री हेयर ओके सो बिफोर स्टार्टिंग बिफोर डूइंग द पेपर प्रीवियस पेपर एनालिसिस लेट मी टेल यू द प्रीवियस पेपर पैटर्न दैट हाउ मेनी क्वेश्चन आर देयर एंड हाउ मच टाइम इज रिक्वायर्ड टू सॉल्व दोज क्वेश्चन हेयर सो इफ यू सी देर आर टोटल अराउंड टू फोर्टी क्वेश्चन एंड आउट ऑफ टू फोर्टी क्वेश्चन वन ट्वेंटी क्वेश्चन आर रिलेटेड टू द टेक्निकल पार्ट एंड द रिमेनिंग वन ट्वेंटी क्वेश्चन आर रिलेटेड टू द नॉन टेक्निकल पार्ट हेयर ओके सो इन द केस ऑफ नॉन टेक्निकल पार्ट इफ यू ऑब्जर्व वी हैव फिफ्टी क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू द रीजनिंग ट्वेंटी क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू द जनरल नॉलेज एंड द रिमेनिंग फिफ्टी क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू द जनरल इंग्लिश ओके सो दिस इज द a uh, non technical question here which comprises of 120 questions here but if you see about the technical subjects here so they are around 120 question again okay they are around 120 question again here okay and for solving all of these 1240 questions you are going to have 150 minutes here okay so that means you are going to get on an average 35 to 45 second for solving each and every question here okay and one more thing uh before the bhel bharat heavy bharat electronics limited had also out the vacancies for the mechanical engineering okay and uh that particular exam and i have also done the previous year paper analysis of the bel also okay and i have told you that in the bel exam you are going to expect 90% theoretical part and the remaining 10% is going to be the numerical portion but if you see the previous pattern of the bhel you are going to see 70% questions are related to the numerical part and the remaining 30% questions are related to the uh, theoretical portion here okay so just make sure that the preparation strategy for both of these exam are going to be different here okay because a lot of numerical questions has been asked from this asked in this particular exam here so while so while preparing for this particular psu you have to be make sure that you choose your subject very carefully okay along with that you choose your questions very carefully here because you are not going to get enough time for solving those questions here and maybe there will be there will be a chance that some question are going to be very very lengthy and there may be a chance that some question are going to be very very uh, sh short here okay so now just see uh, the important subject which are related for uh, which are important for the bhel exam so specifically when we talk about this exam here strength of material is going to be very very important for uh, subject for you in which you can see around 10% weightage is given to you okay we can we can expect around 10 to 15% weightage sorry because the 15 to 16 question has been asked out of the total 120 questions here in both the years and in the same way if you see the about the machine design in the case of machine design also the number of questions are very very large okay which are which has been asked in the 2023 and when we talk about the production engineering production engineering is always a favorite subject for the examiner here okay and the lot of questions has been asked for this particular asked from this particular subject and in this uh, in this exam specifically for the bhel bhel don't expect that the only the theoretical portions are going to be asked in the production engineering because in the production engineering a lot of numericals has been asked from the casting welding as well as the metal cutting here okay in the in the case of thermodynamics you can already see here they are around again 10 to 50% weight, weightage okay and in the thermodynamics also a large number of numericals has been asked here okay and the numerical the level of numerical are also very good okay so don't think that that uh, you all you have to solve the just basic basic numerical and it will be sufficient for you it is not like that okay and in the case of see if we uh, see the applied thermodynamics part in which we cover the refrigeration power plant uh, the number of questions are very very less so i can say you can skip the uh, applied thermodynamics part for the for this psu exam here okay but if you see in the analysis of the bh bel bharat electronic limited in this case a large number of question has been asked from this particular two topics okay now let us move to our next part the fluid mechanics so in the 2019 if you observe the fluid mechanics only 13 questions has been asked okay and in the 2023 the number of questions are has been decreased here only 5 5 to 6 questions are uh, asked in the 2023 exam and along with the fluid mechanics if we go toward the fluid machinery part uh the number of questions are very very high in the 2019 but in case of again 2023 the number of questions are almost nil here okay 
and the next move toward our the heat transfer heat transfer is very very important subject for you specifically for this psu exam here because a lot large number of numerical questions theoretical question has been asked from this particular subject okay and the proper analysis has to be done in the uh, has to be done while preparing this particular subject here and in the case of industrial engineering uh, you can see the number of questions has been significantly increased in the year 2023 as compared to 2019 here okay and in the case of material science also you can see uh, both of these subjects are comprising 10 to 12 20 10 to 15 percent number of 10 to 15 percent questions out of 120 questions here okay so i can say uh, see you have a very limited period of time right now because you also you have an opportunity for bel and you also have an opportunity for bhel okay so you have to be managed you have to manage your studies in such a way that you prepare for both of these psu exam okay so i will only suggest you that while preparing for the bel specifically focus on the theoretical portion because 90 percent is going to be a threat theory here and the remaining maximum 10 percent can be asked as a numerical here but in the case of bhel where uh, after preparing the theoretical portion for the bel exam because it is going to be held in march only okay just go through the numerical portion okay just move toward the just move your strategy uh, preparation strategy towards the solving the numerical part only because in the case of bhl exam you are going to see a large number of numericals a large number of numericals are going to be there and the level of numericals are also going to be very good okay so you have to be very focused that how do you how do you prepare the numericals here okay so uh, just right now you also know that we also have a we have also launched a module for bel and we have already covering the subject from last one to two weeks okay so we also have planned that after preparing the after covering the bl theoretical portion of the bl exam we are specifically starting the uh, practice session in which we are going to cover the all the numerical questions only the numerical question related to all of these subjects okay so that your complete uh, study of the bl exam as well as the bhl exam will be completed okay so my main the my main focus uh, for this video is to provide you the paper analysis and tell you that how to so do the preparation how do how you have to do the preparation strategy for both of these exams okay so i hope it's very clear to all of you okay so just uh, focus on exam okay and just uh, while solving the bhel exam exam paper okay just choose your subject very carefully choose your question very carefully okay and all and always focus on those subject which has uh, which has uh, which has a very high heavy weightage in the previous years here okay so you have to focus on strength of material you have to focus on the machine design theory of machine production engineering as well as fluid mechanics heat transfer and important thing is thermodynamics okay you cannot skip the uh, these five subject you cannot skip strength of material machine design theory of machine production engineering thermodynamics fluid mechanics and heat transfer these seven subjects are those subjects which are very very important for you to all of for all the psu exam as well as for your gate exam as well as for your interview also okay so just uh, prepare these seven subjects very carefully okay along with that uh, cover the theoretical portion understand it very carefully get a very clear idea related to the concept and along with that also solve the numerical portion okay okay so that is for this particular video so thank you very much and all the best for your exams okay whether it is for bharat bharat electronics limited and bharat heavy electronics limited bharat heavy engineering limited sorry okay